Biller traveled to Mafrak, a small Syrian town, to hear refugee stories. Her heart touched by the kids who wanted to become doctors, engineers, and chefs. She decided to make a difference. She created Wings for Dreams, a national fundraising campaign part of her nonprofit, Road to Mafrak. Billard says they have lost their homes, their toys, their friends, their families, and ultimately their country. Let's make sure they don't lose their dreams. Abdul Alhumedi, U of I student, has Middle Eastern relatives. He knows firsthand that Syrian refugees do not have equal opportunities, or really any opportunity at all. Um, we ha I have a cousin um, who's in Germany right now. He just completed his bachelor's in chemistry, but couldn't do anything about it and had to go to Germany. And I just works at an airport terminal as one of those guys directing traffic. So it's, it's very brutal. Alhumedi's cousin is just one story. Billard nationally advocates this campaign promoting Syrian children's education. Alhumedi and Billard both hope that one day children can overcome the hardships of war and achieve their dreams. I'm Mia Rose, UI7 Newsbreak.